Carolyn Doobie here. What's the play for today? Well, it's going to involve the rainbow for sure because I've got the Studio Caddy Premium Gift Set here from Faber-Castell. Now, this thing comes loaded with all these wonderful supplies in it ready for you to play. And one of the fun things about just having this all right next to you as you're playing is you never know what ideas might get sparked, kind of like what happened to me with the gelatos near the end of this video. So what all comes in it? What kinds of things can they do? Well, let's give them a whirl. I'm going to play around here on this manila tag just to play around and get to know the supplies. Now, the first thing I'm going to use are some of the paper crafter crayons. These things are fun to write with, but they're also fun to turn in the tube because you can see in there and that spiral. Well, it's just a little bit addictive for me. One of the things that I really like about the assortment of goodies that they've put into the Studio Caddy is that some react to water and some don't. So the crayons do not react with water, meaning you can put wet stuff on top of them and they're not going to run at all. Now the pit pen, like what I'm using right now, this has a brush tip, so on the side you can get nice big marks, and if you use a tip you can get more detail. This is not going to react to water once you give it a moment to dry. The other thing is you have tips on some of the pens that are a very, very fine tip, which is great for writing and super detail. And again, because it's made with the India ink, once it's dry, it's not going to react with water. And in the kit, you also get some little water misters so that you can spray water on things if you want. Now, what are some of the things that will react to water? Well, these Art Grip watercolor pencils, they definitely react to water. Now, you can use them just like a colored pencil and color things in. If you leave them dry, they look just like a colored pencil. But when you get them wet, they will react and move around so you can move that color around like a watercolor. So I've dipped that brush in water, and as I'm moving it on, the green that was the watercolor pencil, that's becoming softer, a more watercolor look, but the blue that was the paper crafting crayon, that's not moving or going anywhere. Now that purple pit pen that I had there, now that it's had a chance to dry, when I go over it with water, it's not going to move around or react. There are also some big brushes in here, and this one is the white India ink, and it writes right over things like the pit pen, but if you write it over things, say, like the watercolor, then it's going to grab some of that color and move it around. Now, if you don't want to get that color on the tip, all you then do is kind of clean the tip off right on a piece of paper. Or at least that's how I clean off the tips of my pens when I get them into things. Now, for things that you want to sharpen in this, the pencil sharpener is included. There are actually three different sizes in there in that handy pencil sharpener that will also catch the shavings so it doesn't make a mess. You get a bunch of tools in here. You get things like brushes and sponges, but you also get the water pen. And this is a pen with water in it. So what you do is you unscrew it, and then the top part of it, you're just going to fill it with water. So you just put it in the water, lift it up, and it will suck up a bunch of water. Then you can screw it back together, and now you have water that will come out of the tip. So what about the gelatos? Lots of color choices here, but you have more than just color choices. There are actually several different kinds of gelatos in here. If it's got an eye on it, just like that one does, that means it's iridescent. That means there's going to be a little sparkle, a little shimmer to it. Now, I'm just going all willy-nilly on this tag here, not really thinking about it, just moving color around and getting to know the supplies that are in this kit. Now, one of the things that's also in here is a highlighter gelato. Now, to show you what's so awesome about the highlighter gelatos, and yep, it's going to have a little H on the side of it. Now, these act like a highlighter, so I need something under it that I want to peek through. So I use the black big brush pen, and then I'm just going to go right on top of it with the highlighter gelato. It's a very, very translucent gelato, and you can see right underneath it. Now, gelatos do react to water, so after I put some more on here, I'm going to grab that water pen because it always has a wet tip because there's water from the inside of it running down over the brush tip. And so I'm just going to mix the colors around, spread them around. Now, how do I clean off my brush tip? What do I do for that? Well, I usually just wipe it off on a piece of paper. If I do that, that gets the color off of it, and then I can go on to the next color, and I can move that color anywhere that I want on my tag. 
So at this point, I was thinking I was just about finished with this video, but then something really caught my eye, and that's one of the cool things about having all of this stuff right next to you in this caddy. The spatula grabbed my eye, and I decided to just shave off a little bit of the white gelatos and start smearing it around dry on top of this tag. And one of the really nice things about gelatos is that they're creamy. And usually when I do something like this, I add a little bit of water to it, but for whatever reason today, I'm not feeling like doing that. And I'm loving spreading this stuff around. I'm loving it so much, I'm not gonna stop with just one color. I'm gonna do more colors. Now, how much of the gelatos that I shave off will tell me how much of the color that I'm gonna end up there. So if I use a little bit less, I get a little less color to spread around. If I use a little bit more, I get a little bit more color to spread around. And you bet I can always come back with that water pen and move those gelatos around any way that I want to on this tag. Well, thanks so much for joining me for some play with the Studio Caddy gift set from Faber-Castell.